example again, sir. Sovereign, socialist, secular, democratic republic, sir. Sir, what is sovereignty now? Hugging Western leaders from Trump to Biden doesn't mean sovereignty. You finished up now because Nehru's name is there. We don't want non-alignment movement to be there. Just because Jawaharlal Nehru was instrumental in setting up non-alignment movement. The second word, socialism. What is socialism, sir? Socialism has become Adanism. That is a new word, Adanism. P.T. Usha, madam. Socialism better gaya, Adanism ho gaya. Chup cha paitra aap. You should be standing up and talking about that. Secularism. A gentleman sitting in Prime Minister's office had the audacity to say, Dharmendra Prasad, sir. Bibek Debroi. This constitution has become useless. Only 17 years it can stand. And he said he doesn't understand the meaning of socialism and secularism. A gentleman heading the Economic Advisory Council of the Prime Minister had the audacity to come and say that he doesn't understand the meaning of secularism and socialism. I would have expected a cabinet minister, the stature of Dharmendra Pradaji, to say, shut your mouth. Another word, sir, democracy. See, many of the members think, sir, democracy has turned to be democracy or modiocracy. Yeah. Democracy or modiocracy because we don't see the Prime Minister. My daughter was asking, did you get an opportunity to sit with the Prime Minister, sir? I said, no. Very rarely only I get, sir. What does it mean, sir? Democracy means accountability of the executive to the Parliament and Parliament being accountable to the people. That is democracy, sir. Sir, Republic. I know, where is Ragesh Sinaji? For Ragesh Sinha and others, you know what is the meaning of Republic? Vice Chairman, sir, you know what is the meaning of Republic? Arno Goswami. That is the meaning of Republic for many of the Treasury Benches people. That is the state of affairs of this country. Dharmendra ji, please don't look me like this.